Hi friends, welcome back to my channel. It is Krista from Hebert's Down Home. If you are new here, thank you so much for stopping by. I am chuckling because there's a chicken walking past my van. I'm sitting here in the front of my house and my son let one of the chickens roam free and he's just like walking around and that just seems so strange to me. Today is once again grocery shopping day. We shop bi-weekly for our family of eight. I'm headed off to Walmart, Sam's, and Aldi's. So I'm gonna start with my Walmart haul. I'm gonna head there because it's in our local town. And then we'll be heading about 30 miles away to hit Sam's and Aldi's. So our local Walmart just started doing online pickup. I was gonna place an online order today, but decided that I needed to go through the store and just take a look at a few things. So I'm just gonna grab my groceries while I'm in there. And I will try the online pickup again soon. I am sure that I will have lots of opportunities to do that as we get foster kids coming into our home. Life will get crazy and I will be happy to just place some online orders and have Monty or somebody go pick them up for me. So I am headed out right now and I will show you our Walmart haul as soon as I get back. I have my windows open so you guys can hear the cicadas pretty loud today. Okay, this is my Walmart haul. This is what I got at Walmart. This is for a two week time period for a family of eight. Um, I've got some gala apples here. Again, Sam's is out of apples, so I'm gonna get them here. They are also out of romaine lettuce, so I got a couple bags at Walmart. Um, I've got some chopped spinach for lazy lasagna, cottage cheese for lazy lasagna and eating as well. A couple bags of the baked Tostitos. Those are on plan Trim Healthy Mama for Monty and I. Um, taco shells for the kids and Cheerios for the kids. Um, my household items are also included in my grocery budget and I got some soap, um, some bar soap for in the shower. I've got some shampoo. Um, this is a spray and conditioner that we love to use with Nevaeh's curly hair. She has very soft hair, um, but this conditioner is perfect to spray in and get the tangles out. Um, and then I also have a thing of deodorant. I always buy at least one or two of those for whoever needs them. Um, and then I've got some command hooks here. We have a couple of bathrooms that don't have any place for hand towels to go, so they just kind of lay crumpled up on the counter all the time. So I think I'm going to put these on the tile. And they should remove pretty easily later on if we want to. Felt pads, of course. These just wear out. You know, they're on all of our chairs on our wood floors. Um, and so... I think we need to go around replacing those at this point. So anyway, there's the household items. Now back to the groceries. Um, I've got a bunch of canned goods here, some mild diced tomatoes um, and with green chilies. So basically Rotel, the Walmart version of Rotel and some diced tomatoes. I'm gonna do a, I think it's um, Save My Sanity Chili that I'm doing this round. Pinto beans, northern beans. I've got some black beans here for taco salads. Um, I have some Ghirardelli baking cocoa. This is my favorite to use in the Trim Healthy Mama recipes. It just tastes so much better. Um, Truvia. And I got four of the raspberry zingers for my good girl Moonshines. Coffee filters for Monty who drinks a lot of coffee. Um, strawberry jelly for the kids. I also got strawberry all fruit for me. And then I've got some natural creamy peanut butter. I'm going to go with some natural crunchy peanut butter as well this time, just for a little bit of variety in life. Um, I've got a couple bags of the whole wheat white flour. We've been liking baking with that. Um, I've got some low carb tortillas, a couple of bags of bagels for the kids. I've been throwing these in the freezer and pulling one out um, for one day during one morning during the week. Everybody loves the cinnamon raisin, so this works out well for pretty much everybody. Um, I've got two of the French bread, garlic breads, um, to they these were just on clearance so i grabbed them i thought i can throw them with a, as a side dish with maybe the lazy lasagna or something like that for the kiddos to make things stretch a little further got a couple of bags of hot dog buns peyton's gonna grill up some hot dogs for lunch so bought some gut buns to go with those as well as some potatoes we're still doing the baked potatoes for lunches um and so the kids are enjoying that as well so that is our walmart haul for today all right, so this is our Aldi's order for today. Um, I've got, goodness, I don't know how many bags of chips here. I guess five, two bags of taco chips for taco salad and a few other varieties for the kids. Got some bread, whole wheat bread here. And then I also have the sprouted bread. 
I cleaned them out of bread, so. Hold on. Okay, and then for cereal this time, I got the crispy rice again. The kids really liked that. A couple of the raisin bran and um, some of the rice squares, so. I also got six of the macaroni and cheese. That is our Saturday lunch. So we do three of those each Saturday. And then I've got old fashioned oatmeal um, for cooking and for making granola. I also got four of the applesauce. I've got one bag of the baked cheese crackers, a trail mix. I think I've got a Chex mix in here for Monty and two Chex mixes looks like. Then in the frozen, I got a couple bags of peas three, I guess, um, three of the corn, the frozen corn. And I got a couple bags of the frozen fruit, actually three once again, I guess, <laughs> not a couple. Blueberries, um, a couple of the uh, crescent rolls, the kids make pigs in a blanket with those. A couple of the corn for different recipes. Jackson was with me, so he, um, asked for mandarin oranges this time. Got some onion powder, minced onion, a couple of minced onion, and chili powder here. Also have two of the cream cheese, and a can of baked beans for the kids. I have a few of those left at home. They kind of like those with their lunches. Okay, I've got two of the creamy peanut butter. I may have already said that. Take those for me, please. A couple of the almond milk, got three, four of the uncured turkey franks. Got a bag of chocolate chips for some muffins that we make on Fridays. And four of the butter, four boxes of butter and a little bit of bananas. I didn't buy a lot here, we have some at home. And then a couple of the eggs and they were 56 cents, I think a dozen this time. And that's it for our Aldi's order. Okay friends, we just got done with our Sam's Club pickup. I pulled into the parking lot. Monty ran in to get rotisserie chicken because you can't do that with the club pickup. So we like to get a few of those and take them off the bone and just have them on hand at home. So he ran in to do that and I, while he's doing that, I am going to show you what I got at Sam's Club today. Okay, so first of all, I got another big pack of bath tissue. I think we should be finally caught up on that, but I think we're using a little bit more than one a month, so. I've got two cans of the Hunt's tomato ketchup. I got a can of peanuts for snacks. I've got a watermelon in here. Our last Sam's watermelon um, mysteriously exploded on the counter. I'm not sure what happened to it. Um, I also got Folgers coffee for Monty. Got some um, baking soda, aluminum free baking, sorry, baking powder, not baking soda. And I also got some Hellman's mail. Down here, I have a couple more bundles of bananas. These are a little more ripe than the ones that I got at Aldi's. And here's my other can of ketchup. Okay, I got some Mama Lupe's tortillas for the kids. I also got seven pounds of chicken breasts at $1.88 a pound. A bag of coleslaw. Um, some ham, deli meat, whole green beans. These are my favorite. I go through a lot of these. Stir fry. Um, we're going to make stir fry once. Some, so a bag of mozzarella cheese. I believe this is a five pound bag. A five pound bag of the shredded cheddar and six of the skim milk. And it looks like they did good with the expiration date this time. So it won't quite get us to the end, but I will put some of that in the freezer. So that is what we got this time at Sam. Monty ran in to get a few of the rotisserie chickens and then that will finish out our shopping haul for this time. Thank you so much for watching and we will see you next time. Bye-bye.